All the gardeners in Adelaide love their roses. The thing I like about roses is they're, they're the gift that keeps on giving. They're the type of thing that your, your, your average gardener can look after and maintain or your expert can do really well. It's The more time and effort you put into them, the more they give back. They've got the perfect growing climate for roses in Adelaide. We've got the cool winters and warm summers. Not a lot of rain, so it's good for pests and diseases. It's a great area for growing roses. We've got a large team of gardeners all across the city. We've got upwards of 60 odd horticulturalists. They're all experts in their trade and they love what they do. Throughout the city we've got an area down by the riverbank across from the zoo, South Bank. They've got rose beds through there, up through Pennington Gardens and up into Brom, Brom Gardens. Um, we've got a Rymel Park Rose Garden, which is the largest rose garden in the city. And of course where we are here at Ville Gardens, they're both Rymel and Ville are formal rose gardens with a substantial amount of roses. It's the spice of life in Ville Gardens. You get a little bit of everything. You've got beautiful perennial beds, beautiful rose garden, and all the characters that come along with living in the city. So the newest rose garden is the Qingdao Rose Garden. The varieties are bred from the original China rose. The Qingdao Rose is, is around the base of the statue in the garden. It's a couple of years old now, so it's beginning to mature nicely and should be flowering really well in the next couple of years. Oh, the life of a rose. Generally, it's a, a 10 year cycle for roses in the city. We tend to keep new varieties coming in. So we'll plant and they sort of mature over two to three years and then we'll maintain them for the next 10 years or so. And, and obviously by that stage, there was better performing roses. So we tend to run a cycle of new, new varieties when we can, but we also have the old varieties that we tend to maintain as well. Roses take a fair bit of maintenance, a lot of pruning, a lot of fertilising and mulching through winter months. And then of course it's deadheading throughout their flowering cycle across the summers. The best times for the roses are generally mid-October, that's our first flush of the season, and mid-October through to mid-December for a second flush of flowers, and then, then probably more towards, towards Easter times, March, after, after summer we get a, a late flush that's generally a pretty good time for roses across the city. My favourite roses are the old style hybrid tea roses, the ones you'd find in your parents' front yard, backyard, they're um, your Mr Lincoln, your Oklahoma, Blue Moon, um, just Joey, the um, fragrant cloud. There's, there's a, a number of varieties. They've got big blooms and lovely smelling roses. Where's my favourite rose garden in Adelaide? Well, of course, it's Bill Gardens, but Rymel Park's a fantastic rose garden as well and well worth a look. So if you feel like getting out and about and getting some fresh air, come, come down to the Bill Gardens or, or Rymel Park or any of the rose gardens around Adelaide and, and see what we've got to offer.